Congratulations and welcome to the Dungeons Company. As you saw on the job posting, your main task is to protect the treasures we keep in our dungeons. We don't have much time to spend training you, so please keep up. Heroes keep coming to try and take our treasures. The marketing team has worked hard to promise gold and glory to these idiotic adventurers. We have a little time before they get here, so let's place our traps and our employees to prepare a defense. We always leave an empty room in every dungeon. You can use it to ambush the adventurers with one of your favorite spells. Some rooms are dedicated to combat. This is my favorite bit. Make sure you analyze each group of adventurers. Your employees are counting on you to prepare an effective strategy. Pay attention to combatants' attacks and resistances. They are key elements for victory. The job also involves bullying these insignificant humans. No reason work can't be fun! You can of course kill them, or terrify them so much they'll flee like peasants, as you see fit. Don't forget that in battles, the fastest combatants act first. I knew from the start that you had potential. Know that here in Dungeons Company, we reward talent and value ambition. Shoot for the moon! And so, your training ends. I'll see you again next year for your annual evaluation. If you do a good job in protecting our treasures, you'll get the promotion you deserve. Torture? It's a passion! Let's 
Let's get to work! Welcome to the company, Mog. I am delighted to have you with us. We'll need your fabled management techniques. We're putting you in charge of a little team in the Old Empire, a region overrun by humans. It's up to you to gather the monsters in the area and teach them how to defend themselves. Turn them into great employees, ready to give their lives multiple times for the company. As you could probably guess, dying isn't the nicest experience. Fortunately, our Lich Doctor is here to resurrect your employees for free. However, being dragged back to the land of the living after a taste of eternal peace can be quite demotivating. If your employees die too often, they might suffer from burnout. Your employees' morale is therefore a matter to be taken seriously. Give them a break from time to time, by sending them to the garrison. The feasts organized after a victorious defense will make them want to get back into action. 